Hi teachers, it's Kat again from catteacher.com. I wanted to show you today part two of our video series, how to create a border. So basically what you would love is a bright, beautiful border. So um, you can see at the apartment that I'm staying at, you can kind of see my bed in the background. You can kind of see some things on the wall. And uh, we'd like to just create a border that's gonna be transparent and it's going to sit around me. Um, so I've created a ton of really cool borders and I just wanna show you how to download those items and put them into your mini cam. Now I'm still in the free version. Don't worry, everything we do today is you're gonna be able to use for the free version. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Uh, if you go down, we've got some presets. We've got the video, we've got audio time, blah, blah, blah. We're gonna go down to our effects, okay? So we'll click the effects here and we can have a look. And you do have a couple of borders uh, that you can start with. This is a little border you could just put on top, which is cool. So you can see that the border just sits on top of you and doesn't move. Um, now I'm gonna show you how to create something that looks like this. Uh, basically, I've created this border and I will show you how to create the file and then upload it straight to Minicam and it's really easy. So uh, let's go ahead and we'll start by going to my website, okay? So uh, in the email that you got today, you've got a link to this web page, which is cool. And basically these are all the borders that I've created for teaching English online. Uh, here's a quick video just in case um, you know this video doesn't make any sense. Here's another video for adding the borders. But um, you can go, uh, for the most part, some of the newer ones that I've made, you can just simply click which one you want. So I want the one with the Dada ABC border. I'm going to click on it. It's going to automatically download which is super easy and super cool. And you can see this file down here is an MCV file, which ManyCam can read. So I click on that, ManyCam is excited, then I can simply click on that. And it just, it just shows up, it shows up in my border um, folder and it's really easy to download like that. Now, if you find something else or if you'd like to make your own borders, um, basically, I will show you also how to do that. You can go down and you might find, let's see, let's go with this one because I haven't actually um, created the files for this yet. So if you find a border that you like, you can click on the border. All of them are 1200 by 900. Those fit that four to three square ratio that we talked about in the last video. You're gonna right click and you're gonna save the image as something. So we'll just save it maybe as a, you know, data, data background. I don't know, something like that, save. Okay, so it's gonna go into our downloads file here. Basically from here, you are gonna go to Minicam. So let's go to minicam.com and we are gonna go to resources. So here you have your resources, you're gonna click effects and you're gonna come into your effects here. This is really cool if you wanna find some free effects. All you have to do is download these. Uh, you can do whatever you'd like. Uh, but here, this is special. You're going to create effects. And when you create these effects, you will be able to immediately download them as a file that, uh, that ManyCam can read and you can easily do that. So let's see if we can make this a little bigger so that we can see. So we're gonna drop the effect here that's pretty easy. So right now that looks a little small, right? That doesn't look like it's gonna cover my face. So we need to come down and change the category a little bit. Now this is gonna be a full screen effect. Okay, so that immediately starts working. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and put it as a border and that will put it into the right folder when you get back into Minicam. And I'm just gonna call it trial border data. You can see I've already done this before. So trial border data, great all looks good. I want you to download it. If you publish it to ManyCam, then I don't actually get any credit for the border that I've created. So definitely just download it personally. You can click the button here. You can see that friendly smile again, that looks familiar. So we click this one, open up your ManyCam, and you'll find it right here in your borders. Okay, so now I can click this one off, and I can click the new one on. Okay, so these are um, how you would move from, you know, if you want to add a border like this and then take it away, add the border, take it away, something like that. 
Okay, so I hope you guys uh, have a beautiful border set up uh, already. Um, if you still have any questions, feel free to ask us, especially in our Facebook group. So if you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to ask. All right, talk to you soon. Bye.